If there's anything that the aerial footage of today's incident makes clear, it is just how desperate the situation on the ground is. People need more food. They need more water. They need medicine and other humanitarian goods, and they need it now. We continue to make clear in all of our discussions with the government of Israel that all possible measures must be taken to allow the entry of more assistance into Gaza through as many points of access as possible and to enable safe and secure distribution of that aid throughout Gaza. And when you think about today's tragedy, it is especially heartbreaking to consider how many of those families affected will be burying loved ones, not for the first time. In fact, I'm sure that many of those affected have buried multiple loved ones over the, since this conflict began. When it comes to establishing facts on the ground, <clears throat> we are urgently seeking additional information on exactly what took place. We have been in touch with the Israeli government since early this morning and understand that an investigation is underway. We will be monitoring that investigation closely and pressing for answers.